Come back from five weeks in America. We did a, a grueling schedule over there. Covered mm. a lot of miles, yeah. uh, but we had a great time. Went down really well. Mm. And, uh, we're and still recovering. We're still <laughs> recovering. <laughs> but now we're, you know, we're back over here and ready to play in the UK again. Yeah. 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 People were up for partying, yeah. and we partied. Yeah. And we we gave them an English party. Yeah. We even uh, performed on Fox TV, which was pretty surreal for us. <laughs> <laughs> like, it, yeah. Box 11 on LA. It's like really? GMTV. Was it? Extra sugar. Oh, yeah. amazing. <laughs> um, well, I imagine, I imagine in America, I mean, certainly Mumford and Sons and Folk, I mean, they're, they're pretty open to it, aren't they? They're pretty yeah. kind of like ready. Yeah, it. yeah, yeah. And I think, I mean, we're slightly different from the, those sort of bands because yeah. we're taking a quite uh, English version mm. of folk over there. 
whereas that kind of stuff tends to be a bit more Americanized. Mm. So we're, we're very English. But that's quite good because a, a lot of the Americans sort of claim some sort of heritage from this neck of the woods anyway. So it seems to seems to be touching them somewhere in their, you know, yeah. soul. That and the room. <laughs> that, that, that's, we've got to talk it about. might be the room. It might be just the room. Yeah. We had our first guy carried off the dance floor really? by his friends after lying in a pool of his own sit. So that was fun. Ooh, we must talk about the rum because I've seen you guys play and it's, it really is an exciting affair. Uh, the last time I saw you had a gaggle of girls there in dresses. Mm, my like skinny this. sisters. Yeah. My adorable skinny sisters. <laughs> and then you do. Is it? Is it fair to call it a keg of rum that you feed the crowd? Flagon of rum. Flagon. Flagon of rum. That like starts the fun. Yeah. Where did, where did that idea come from? When did you start doing that? I, I like rum. Yeah. yeah. We had a flagon. Yeah. Let's Put fill it up. <laughs> <laughs> and then I was drinking it. And then I thought, well, I'm dancing because I'm drinking it. Maybe if you have some, you'll have as much fun as me. I think it's the festival and the music. etiquette as well, you know. So, you know, you go to a festival and you've got... Uh, room on you, you, the instant thing is to sort of give it out yeah. and stuff. So I think it was just Share, from yeah. one of those festivals that we've been playing, it's one of the things that just sort of stuck with us and now we try and sneak into every possible venue we can. Yeah. Yeah. Some yeah. venues don't, yeah, don't want it, but we, uh, we, we do our <laughs> best. Bring it anyway. We yeah. smuggle it in and, you know, we try and get Push it out if we can. That's not fair. This is the blame game now. Basically, our most important gig in LA, um, it was the busiest crowd and uh, Muir was doing, was it New Cross Girls? Like and I started dancing around the stage and then the sound just totally... Dancing over all the wires and everything. Just I, was thinking, I think rum was going everywhere, <laughs> heels were going everywhere and then the sound just went. Oh my love. 